Yo, what's going everybody, man? We are back with another day of Doula, another day of being charged up, and today we're gonna see what if Michael Jordan and Shaq play together during their NBA careers. So we're here in 2K23, the year is 1991, and Chicago Bulls have two star, future star players, rookie Michael Jordan and rookie Shaquille O'Neal, and we're gonna see how they will be together. As you guys know, you know, Shaq played with Kobe, but how would he be with MJ? I saw a clip on Twitter the other day of like someone saying it wouldn't work out just because Jordan would expect so much out of Shaq, Shaq couldn't handle it and he would get bullied, basically, something like that. But in 2K, I feel like this would be the best duo out of all the videos, this could be the most dominant one of all time. Before we get into it, man, drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, and comment down below what duos do you want to see team up next. This is probably the most interesting one yet. Very high expectations. Let's get into it. So, shooting guard and center, 85-84 overall. I got rid of Horace Grant. You know, Scottie Pippen is not on the team. It's just them two and then a bunch of role players. If we look at the best centers currently, we have David Robinson, Pat Ewing, Hakeem Olajuwon, and that's really it. Like, Shaq is already a top 10 center as a rookie. And I also got rid of him in the prospect scouting, so I removed him from the draft class so he won't be drafted again. So, let's go ahead and simulate up to all-star break and see how we do. The goal for this video is to win a ring uh, basically every season besides the rookie year. I'm going I'm to give him some slack on the rookie season, but every year following that, I'm expecting a ring and MVPs for Jordan and Defense Player of the Year for Shaq. Nothing but greatness is what I expect, bro. Do you guys think Shaq would have had a better career with Jordan or would he just have a better career with Kobe? Like, I think Jordan would probably bring the most out of him, so maybe like... Maybe this could have been better for him. You never know. But what I do know is um is off topic, but Tim Hortons, bro, not sponsored, of course. Like, I don't drink coffee that much anymore, or even iced coffee. Tim Hortons, iced coffee, vanilla, uh, two cream, two sugar. Go ahead and order that next time you go to Tim Hortons, bro. You're welcome. Best thing ever. It got me charged up right now, for real. You know what I'm saying? So, we're 32 and 16 at All-Star break. How we looking? So, Jordan is averaging how much? 31 points and, hold on, two steals and one block per game, and Shaq is averaging 21 and 10. Are they both in the dunk contest? I wanna see. Uh, just Jordan, not Shaq. All right, we'll keep on going. I mean, rookie rookie season, we could have Jordan win MVP. I mean, it's happened before in a couple of videos where the rookie wins MVP, and if anyone could do it, it's Jordan. On a side note too, I'm really, really surprised that uh, 2K didn't send me like a message saying to take down that John Morant TikTok video I made. I, I was expecting 100% 2K to send an email saying, yo, take the video down, because like, there was a gun in 2K. There's no way, it, I, I was so shocked they didn't ask me to take it down. So shout to 2K, you know, appreciate that. But uh, Clyde wins MVP, Michael Jordan Rookie of the Year, and then defensive player is David Robinson. And, and you know, last video a while back, I said there was a story with Shaq and David Robinson. Apparently it was made up. You know what I'm saying? So isn't that crazy? You know, crazy. Jordan should have been MVP. Look at his stats. 31 points. Hold on, it keeps doing this thing. I'll show you guys in a second. Jordan's all NBA first team. Shaq is nowhere to be found. So we're the fourth seed in the East already, which is really good. But let's see the stats now. Jordan averaged 31 points, four, five, two steals and one block is crazy. And then Shaq averaged 22 and 10. So in 2.3 blocks a game. So far, so good. Now we're up against the Hawks, of course, with Dominique Wilkins. But actually, no, he's probably older now, I think. Yeah, he's 32, he's still good, but I mean, they're not really a, a challenge for us. We'll probably sweep them. Ah, whoa, we win 3-2. We won by seven points in game five. Shaq with the big double-double, and nobody shoots threes. So yeah, not on our team at least, no one shoots threes. So we're up against the first seed Cavaliers now, who have Scottie Pippen, Brad Daugherty, Mark Price, Larry Nance. Ooh, they got a good team, but we got it. If we win this series, we're on the right track to just completely dominate this video. But they are going to sweep us. Damn. Lost by five, then by 30. Goodness. Then by four, and then by, okay. Wasn't horrible. But like I said, rookie year, I'll cut them some slack. So uh, the Cavaliers end up winning it against the Lakers, and Brad Dart wins Finals MVP. Year number two, and you see how fast they jump in overall 91 and 89 overall. Off the jump. Like, this is gonna be insane. So the top players in the league now. Clyde Drexler, Carmelo, D-Rob, Stockton. So the Utah Jazz should go to the finals on paper just because they have the two best players out of the top four. But hey, I am expecting a finals appearance this season. Year number two, Jordan wins the MVP and he'll probably be on the streak for a minute, averaging 32 points, bro, what? I mean, that's crazy. And then defensive player goes to Hakeem this time. 
Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. All NBA first team, we got Jordan and Shaq already off to a great start. And all defensive first team has Jordan and Shaq is not all defensive somehow. Don't know how. But we're the first seed in the East. What was our record? Let's see. We finished 65 and 17, best in the league, um, trailing behind or right over the Jazz and Cavaliers. So our defense is insane. 99 points a game allowed and we score 114. Makes sense. Jordan's one of the best defensive players ever, along with Shaq. So now I want to see how much Shaq averaged though. Yeah, 92, 90 overall. So Shaq averaged 26 and 10. Damn. Yeah, his really good season. The fact that he's getting 26, Jordan's getting 32, and then BJ Armstrong is still getting 13. It's a great sign. Let's actually see the top uh, scores, the lead leaders. Literally, Jordan and Shaq are the lead leaders right now, crushing. Then Dominique, Carmelo, Clyde, Kendall Gill. Um, okay, cool, cool, cool. We're up against the Celtics, easy sweep. Yup, 3-0. The bad boy Pistons. I love the Pistons, but we gotta sweep them too. Cavaliers might be a chat. Ooh, Cavaliers are a challenge. Two and two. We're up 3-2 and game seven. Woo, okay. I wanted a challenge, man. I, I low-key just woke up a minute ago, so I need something to like wake me up for real. And the game seven against the Cavs is gonna do that. Not really, but we're crushing them. Yeah, crushing them. <laughs> That's too easy. Jordan with 38 points, no threes. And then Shaq with 27 and 10. Yeah, Jordan Sim. And we're up against the Blazers in the finals. Ooh, they got Brad Daugherty during the off season. Interesting. So Clyde, Brad, Terry Porter, Jerome Kersey, rest in peace. Kevin Duckworth, rest in peace. Uh, yesterday's video, I said rest in peace to Ralph Sampson. Turns out he's alive. So that's I'm, I'm very happy to hear that. And my fault for getting that wrong. But um, that was really embarrassing. Hopefully he didn't see that. But hey, game one, they take it. And we take game two. Up 2-1, 3-1, Simcast time, baby. Damn, they are crushing us. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how, but they, uh, yeah, they definitely crushed us there. Almost came back. Jordan with 38. Wasn't enough for Clyde's 36 and Brad's 20. 3-2, here we go. Back and forth game. Yes, sir. This is when I should jump in. Like, right about here. Up by one with three minutes left. All right, give the ball to Jordan, John. No, 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 no. Give the ball to Jordan or Shaq. Jordan well, giving it to BJ Armstrong. Babyface Armstrong, he finishes in the paint. Terry Porter, what you got? Pulling up for the midi. No, sir. Damn, they got three. Buck Williams, the putback. I think that's Buck Williams, bro. Um, Matter of fact, here's proof I know ball. Uh, Willie. Buck Williams. Bro, I know basketball. Y'all keep playing me like I don't. All right, Jordan. You can take class spin move. Ooh, ooh, you should have kept going to the paint. Instead, we're going to feed it to Thornwell, to Jordan. All right, he's going to take him. Yes, sir. I'll take that. Let's see what Terry Porter has, man. Pulling up for the midi again, and he drains it. Jordan, you can hit, you can hit a three, bro. Don't be scared to take it. You got an A minus three point rating. Kick out, kick out. Or he takes a contested shot. You had you had John Paxson wide open for three. All right, bro, we're still up by one. Minute and a half left, and we're staying solid in the paint. Yes, sir. Get that read. Get it, let's go. Let's feed it to Shaq, maybe. I don't know. Give it to Shaquille O'Neal, bro. Good screen. Yo, he's taking him. Do something, bro. Half spin, pass to John Paxson. What are y'all doing? All right, screen. Paxson for the midi. Woo, big shot. Let's go. Terry Porter trying to draw a foul when he does. He did miss one of the free throws, so we can make it a two possession game right here if we give it a shack in the paint. But instead, Jordan has the ball, trying to take Terry Porter. Kicks out, BJ Armstrong for three. Oh my God. All right, it's still a game, it's still a game. Terry Porter attacking the paint, drawing another foul. First free throw is up and he missed it. Woo! Yo, he sold. Sorry, Terry. He so he missed both of them. Wow. Wow. And Shaq gets fouled. So now he might miss a couple free throws as well. First one is up and it's in. How does Shaq make a free throw before Terry Porter does? Ah, he made both of them. Wow. Terry for the midi. Yeah, he sold, bro. He cost him the chip. He cost him a chip and boom. We win our first ring. Yo, Jordan had 43. Shaq didn't even score much. He only had six points. But yo, Jordan did it. And this duo goes on to win their first ring. Jordan averaged 34 points, five and six. And that concludes the 1993 season. We'll keep going up until like LeBron gets drafted and we'll see like how, how well we could do. Don't forget that uh, Kobe joins the league too. In the year three, they're already at 94, 93 overall, so. Now it's about to be smooth sailing. And Jordan is back-to-back -back MVP. This se season he averaged 35 points, six and six. Yeah, now he's going crazy. Penny Hardaway Rookie of the Year. 
and defensive player goes to Shaq. Another goal has been met, and Shaq put up good numbers too. 29 points and 12 reads and three blocks. He's on their first team. Okay, dope. But we're the second seed this year, which is weird. So I want to see what the Hornets have to be competing with, with us like that. Larry Johnson, Kendall Gill, Del Curry. Now that's kind of wild. Hold on. Injuries are off, by the way. I started making sure of that. And they won one more game than us. But still. Again, Jordan and Shaq, the two league leaders on the same team, makes no sense. But 2K has them working out really well together. I will sim with the entire playoffs this time and see if we can sweep our way to the finals. No. No. Oh! Yo! The bullets? Hold up. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You tell me Perv J. Humphreys. So a Perv Humphrey and Doc Rivers. These guys beat us in five. Not even seven, but in five. Game one we lost, even though Jordan had 33. This dude went off. Then we won by 12, because Shaq had 42. Then we lost by eight, even though Shaq had 38. Jordan only had nine. And we lost by one. Bro, and we lost by two. That's ridiculous. That's actually stupid, okay. All right, fair play, Warriors win it. Didn't expect that at all. And now they're in 96 and 95 overall. Are we the two best players in the league? Uh, basically, no, Carmel, I mean, this guy is, he's tied first, but he's gonna, he's gonna fall off hard, hopefully. Um, but yeah, basically, I'm not gonna count him as a, uh, yeah. I mean, these are the top three players, pretty good. This, this time around, uh, Jordan ends up winning Defense Player of the Year instead of Shaq, so he's crushing it, averaging 34, 6, 7, 3 steals, a block, like, I mean, he's going off. And then Shaq is also, so Pippen is also doing well in Cleveland. He's doing his thing. And we're the, back in the first seed. Now this year, this year, I'm expecting nothing but greatness from us. Like, I'm expecting a ring type beat. Like, like, a sweep, like sweeping our way to the, no, we already lost one game. Yo, yo, brother, brother, brother. I'm, I'm happy the Pistons won it, but I'm not happy. The Magic beat us in six. We don't have depth. That's what it is. We don't have it. That's why we're losing these games. We lost by 22. Nick Anderson had 34, bro. And they got Alonzo Mourning instead of Shaq, so. Zoe was pretty good, 90 overall, but still. Game two, Michael Adams beats us, and then we end up winning by 11. Yeah, I don't know, that's that's crazy. Pistons win it though, they swept him, I like that. They got Tim Hardaway? Yeah, Tim Hardaway went to Detroit. So he's back-to-back -back finals, uh, he, won, he won back to back rings. Very interesting, let's keep going. All right, now they're the undisputed top two players at the age of 23 and 22, it's ridiculous. Very ridiculous, but let's get it. It would be nice if we had a better bench, but I feel like these guys can get the job done. I don't know. Shaq back at it now in Defensive Player of the Year. He averaged, what, let's see, 30 points, 11, and three blocks. And then Jordan averaged 35 points. So we got two of these dudes averaging 30 points basically on the same team. Never happens, by the way. Never happens in these simulations. So that's already, yeah, Jordan's 99 overall. Damn. Damn. Yeah, I mean, Shaq with, <laughs> makes no sense. This duo is going great for both of them. But not in the playoffs, it's not. I mean, individually it's going great, but in the playoffs, we are struggling. All right, round two, here we go. We're up against Philadelphia, and they have Percy Hawkins. Nah, bro, no way Perv beats us again. Ain't no way. Damn, one more, come on, come on. 4-2, thank you, thank you, damn. We're up against the Suns. Do they have Charles Barkley? Sir Charles is not on the team. They got Jay Kidd, Kevin Johnson, a lot of couple guards there, and then Dan Majerle. We'll be all right. We're gonna win the ring right here. Whoa, down 3-1, what? Game one, we lost by one point. That's some BS, okay? Game two, we won. Game three, we lost by 15. Yo, our bench is whack. That's, that's the issue, bro. They have players across the board dropping double digits. Game four, they won by 20. Okay, <laughs> Simcast time, baby. Woo. If we end up not winning a ring here, I'll be very disappointed. I'm expecting a comeback, man. Yo, 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 make it closer. Damn, bro, not even close. And they beat us because of their bench. Because of their bench, they beat us, man. We gotta get that figured out. All right, well now we're what, we're five years in the game. We'll get the show for it. All we have for Jordan is four MVPs, only one chip. That's all that matters, one chip. Shaq has one chip, four all-stars, two defense players. That's dope and all, but we should be winning rings. What, what are the game highs right now? We got Jordan with 58 points in the game, Shaq with 54, considering they don't shoot threes, it's pretty impressive. Shaq with eight blocks. Jordan with how many steals? Eight and seven blocks, 16 assists. No excuses. Now we're the second seed. If you don't want to ring here, I'm gonna be pissed. 
I'm be pissed. There we go. All right, all right, all right. I'll slow down. So I'm going a little too. I think I'm going a little too fast here. Okay. Now we're up against the Supersonics. We are in the year of 1997. Seattle Supersonics have Scottie Pippen, of course, Gary Payton. So it's the two best defensive players of their position. Ricky Pierce, Kevin. Ek okay. All right. This is this is our ring to win. Game one, we take it. Yeah. One one. Damn. No. Two two. Simcast time, baby. All right, tie ball game, we're playing at home. I actually like this matchup a lot. They uh, are better on paper though, but they're, they're deeper of a team. Back and forth, oh, I gotta jump in right now. Three minutes left, down by three. Interestingly enough, Jordan is not guarding Pippen. Yo, he got lost, yo. All right, we got three. All right, Jordan's not wearing 23, I noticed. He's wearing 24, that's weird. BJ Armstrong is now a star on our team. Funny enough, kick out to Jordan, kick out. Or give it a shack. Brother, pass the ball. We got Ferry. Kick out. One more pass. Oh, Ferry. Good move. Okay. Pippen for three. Wide open. We got lucky he missed that. Shaq in the paint. You got that. Kick out in the corner. Now you got it. My fault. That's too easy. Pippen. Nah, we're there. Good defense. Edwards can't shoot the ball because he was wide open. Now he's going up for the midi. Ain't no way. Get the re. Damn. Shaq. All right. Paint's covered. No. Let's go. Newman. Give it to Shaq, brother. Or you got it. No, you shouldn't. <laughs> like, bro, it's so obvious. If I'm, on, if I'm on the court, if I'm playing on this team, I'm giving it to Shaq every time. It's just common sense. Back in the day when I played ball, I would always give it to the big guy in the paint. Whether he could make it or not, it just makes sense. Ricky Pierce, get that out of here. No. Good put back. That was good. Oh, nah, Pippen for the midi. Woo. <laughs> he tried it. Okay. Jordan has 30. Ricky Pierce has 27. Bro, this is tough. Down by three with a minute left. We need timeout. Let's go. Don't step back. Court, damn it. I knew it. Oh, we called timeout. Oh, we called timeout. I thought it was a violation. I thought he for sure stepped. He did a backcourt violation. But I, I mean, that was a weird call for a timeout. It's kind of stupid. CPU, 2K. Let's work on that next year. All right. Pass the ball in. All right, Shaq to Armstrong. Minute left. We're going for a two, not a three. Be smart. Cross, cross. Yeah. Good pass to Shaq. Yeah. And one. Ah. Free throw time, can he hit him? First one is up and he bricks it. All right, second free throw. Take your time. Damn it, damn it. No, no, sir. No, sir. Pippen. Oh, get the re. All right, we got lucky. 24 seconds left. This is it. This is it. Are we going for a three or a two? Jordan for the midi. Oh my God, you are retarded. That was dumb. That was dumb. We lost. We lost. We lost that game. Nice, bro. Good stuff, Jordan. 30 points for Jordan and Shaq, but we lost because these guys are just deeper. They're like, they're a deeper team. And now we're down two to three. Okay, Simcast once more. I'm not gonna hop in, because I'm expecting this to be a blowout for us, right? No? Word, word, 2K? Make another close one? Really? Now we got a big enough lead. All right, we're cool. Win by 13. Good. Shout out to Julian Newman, dropping 23 for us. Okay, 3-3, three, three, game seven. This is it for our second ring. Only our second ring. And we have a good lead right here. I like where this is going. Yeah, I like where this is going, 2K. Yes, sir. We win another one by 30 points. Shaq had 32. Jordan had 28. Armstrong had 25. Whoo, close one. Close, man. Went to game seven. Jordan wins finals MVP. All right, that's two rings in like, what, six years. And now Shaq wins MVP. So both of them ended up winning MVPs and DPOYs. So that's a success individually. But now... Let's win our third ring, you know? I mean, Kobe and Shaq three-peated. We lost in the first round against the Philadelphia 76ers. What was that about? What was that about? What the hell? <laughs> what? Nah, dude, this dude Purvis is, is pissing me off. Wow. We let up. We, I mean, Sean Kemp, Doug Chris. I mean, what? Deadass? I mean, I'm, I got like two more seasons in me. If we don't win a, uh, one ring in the next two seasons, I'm, I don't know what to do. I'm, 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 I'm done. You would think that this would be like an easy 10 ring straight with this duo, but no. And now KG swoops in and steals an MVP from us. Okay. Kevin Garnett is always in these videos. He'll always like be really good. We're the first seed again, but I'm not fooled. Can't fool me, bro. Can't fool me. I know how this goes. We win the first. We almost <laughs> lost the first round. Ah, okay. Okay. I like this. I like that. 2-1. Yeah. 3-1. Okay, okay, okay. Finally. Another ring force of Shaq wins finals MVP. Yo, we got to see the box score. Game one, 35 and tw 26. Game two, Shaq had five blocks. Uh, Jordan had 30 and 12. Then Shaq had nine blocks. God damn. He could have had a quadruple double, really. Nine blocks is insane. 
and we still lost that game at four. Then he had a game with four blocks, and then he finished it off with three blocks and winning the chip. Dope, man. Let's keep going. All right, we're in the year of 2000. I said we'll go till 2003, and, and I'm a man of my word. And I'm gonna check where Kobe, whoa, 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 whoa. Game seven against the Heat. Wait a minute. Whoa, 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 hey. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We're playing in Miami. We are getting crushed a little bit right now, but, but, um, there is no, there is no, that's it, we just got crushed, okay, whatever, whatever, like, oh, D-Rob, T-Mac, Pages, Tiakovic, yeah, right, we wouldn't have won that, we had no chance, and the Heat win a ring, of course, all right, fair enough, fair enough, well, let's see how Kobe's doing, bro, how's our boy Kobe, best players in the league, Kobe's up there already, in Toronto, and then AI's in Indiana, okay, respect, 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 still the top two players in the league, got a couple more years in me, and we lost in the first round against the Cavaliers, oh, man, Oh man, I got, no, fuck it, I got one more year in me. This is horrible. This is not going to as planned at all. All right, man, this might be my last season, bro. We end off as the second seed. We're up against the Raptors. If we don't win, if we want to go to the finals this year, I'm done. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. Ooh, all right, all right, all right. We're winning game seven. All right, dope. I'm just trying to tag on some more chips, man. One more season. One last one. Here we go. Because, you know, we got to end it as soon as Jordan, or uh, LeBron enters the league because he's the GOAT, obviously, is LeBron. There we go. Go ahead, dislike the video. And Jordan is back as MVP in his last dance. Ha, did you get? And he wins defense player of the year as well. We're the first seed. We can end off this, in this entire video with the ring. We have four chips so far. Let's make it five, bro. Let's make it five. Shaq won five in real life, I believe. Okay, never mind. Fuck it. <laughs> the Bucks swept us. What the hell? What? Vince Carter, he do, and then these guys. What? What? Whatever. All right, bro. This video did not go as planned at all. We end up with four rings, six MVPs for Jordan, uh, one MVP for Shaq, and then Jordan's career high was 62 points. Shaq's career high was 54. Bro, how is their averages looking like though? My guy Shaq, he went he went off. 25 points, 10 rees, 2.4 blocks. Really good career with Jordan. Definitely he played great. Um, and then Jordan, he averaged insane numbers: 31, 5 and 7, 2.6 steals. The duo was great. But I think our bench was just lacking, which was the reason we didn't win like 10 rings in a row. But hey, that's what would happen in 2K if you teamed up Jordan and Shaq. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'll catch you guys tomorrow, man. Peace.